Good Intentions, a 30th anniversary tribute to the Nintendo Entertainment System, chronicles the history of the NES in a way that could only be done by someone with the utmost respect and nostalgia you could only get by growing up in the era. The 326-page book is available in both color and black and white, although I'm not sure why anybody would want the black and white version. The reason why I say this is because the book is simply beautiful. It features full-page colored layouts of everything from technical readouts of chipsets to screenshots of the game that is featured on the page. If you were ever interested in the Nintendo Entertainment System, this book is for you. One of my personal favorite sections of the book is the opening, which chronicles the events that led up to the creation of the NES, as well as the people that were involved. There are write-ups that detail their entry into the gaming market in the form of our, their arcade machines, and dive deeper into the Famicom and NES with full pages dedicated to the 10 NES security chip, which notoriously caused the blinking screens we're all so fond of, as well as the zero insertion force slot, which gave the NES its toaster or VCR attributes. Each section is broken up into eras and years and features a list of games that were either hidden gems or staples in the console's lineup. In between each section, there is a page listing all games that were released that year along with their corresponding box art. The book doesn't just stop with games though. There are also multi-page articles featuring failed accessories and peripherals and even a few pages on Nintendo Power Magazine. If you grew up in the 80s or early 90s and the NES played a part in your life, then I recommend picking up this book. There's a little something in here for everyone, and it is a great way to both learn more about the NES as well as possibly transport you back to your childhood.